I woke him up. <laughs> I don't think a couple of hummingbirds are gonna attack me. I'm right by their nest, but <laughs> this is the spot with the best lighting. You can kind of hear a frog over there too. To think that becoming a troll and dwelling under a bridge would put me most in touch with wildlife during these vlogs. You can hear a frog over there too. Well, oh, that's pleasant. What the fuck is this? Um... Do you guys see that? I realize I'm kind of weird. And I don't mind it. In fact, I'm pretty sure I like it. Not decisively. It's not like, I'm weird and I like it. I'm not justifying it. I feel like I'm weird because I chose to be weird. Like, I could've done conventional things and lived conventionally and had conventional friends and met a girl and got married had a kid or have or I could have one you know I'm so young but I feel like I could easily live and have had been living more conventionally than I am easily but I just didn't want to centipede there's a centipede down there all kinds of suspicious shit down here <sighs> That's sort of why I named myself the Unicorn, because uh, I always felt like uh, I just didn't want to be conventional or belong. I always thought of myself as a mythical creature. You can also think of me as something weird, like a troll who spends his time underneath bridges, but whatever, you know, it's a matter of perspective when it comes to metaphors. <sighs> Being more in touch with nature down here makes me feel like more of a unicorn, too. You can hear the frogs, you can see the birds, but I don't really know uh, where the birds went. I think they found another, there's like nests all over the place down here. You can tell the birds have been living down here for a while, and they're all like falling apart, and their freshest one is like right there. You can tell. Oh, there's another one on the, on the light of twigs. Can you hear the cars? This is kind of a cool spot. Except for the fucking lovely Satan in the pussy. Um, whatever the fuck that means. It's like it. It's the only graffiti. It's right under the light. <laughs> I like going out at night. I think precisely because there are less people. I mean, I guess that was pretty obvious probably but I just I just uh, it's not it's not I feel like it's not so much that I hate people as much as I like being alone uh, at one point I talked about how much I hate people but I don't think I do it's more than just that they're annoying you know like fucking mosquitoes it's like I don't really hate mosquitoes they know they probably serve their purpose, but they're fucking annoying, you know? That's what it feels like with people everywhere. They're all like mosquitoes, fluttering around, doing their thing, making noise, bothering you with their general presence. Call me an asshole, but people are annoying, and I like being alone. Of course, I don't mind some people, because there are some cool people out there. Ah. But Joe, most general people are like mosquitoes. At a soccer game, somebody complimented me on being flexible because the ball was coming and I like kicked my leg up to get it. But it wasn't that high. I feel like, I feel like maybe it was, but it doesn't make me flexible because my knee was still bent. I was like scrunched over like an old man trying to get it. I like to think of myself as a bit of a, a bit of a rover. I feel like I should, I just, I just want to do whatever I want to do, really. I don't want to, I mean, 
And now a lot of times to make money and make your way in the world, you have to do what? You have to do things that you don't necessarily want to do. You know, you have to work hard. Even on YouTube, you know, you have to do what your audience wants. You have to, you have to fulfill a certain standard. Usually, I don't think that would necessarily work for me either, but maybe it would. I don't know. <sighs> Point is, I don't want to do that. I guess that's why I dropped out of college and why I want to be a YouTuber. Because while there are a lot of restri possible restrictions on being a YouTuber, you know, generally you can do, a, you have a lot more freedom than literally anything else. And I just want to have freedom. That's all I want. I want money and time. Just to do whatever I want. So I guess, ideally, I would hope that this, if I could have any anything right now, well, if I could have anything, I just ask for a bunch of fucking money, that would be great. But, I mean, like, something simple, you know, low key, not too ambitious. If I could have anything like that, it would be just to like make a living off of this vlog because then I could have money and do basically whatever the fuck I want and have people watching. That would be ideal for, for me. Of course, I don't know if that's really gonna work. Probably not. So we'll see what happens. I'm gonna have to get a job at some point because I don't want to live with my parents for too damn long. You know, I think that might be it for today's video. Just hanging out under a bridge with some birds and some frogs and some centipedes. Woo! That's, that's the life, dude. That is the life. I hope you guys all appreciate this awkward video. But um, that's not exactly new news, you know? It's not a surprise. It's some weird video. Uh, this, is what, this is what this is fucking the unicorn thing is turning into. Me going to random locations at night and talking about weird, weird shit. <sighs>